आज सुबह मैं पार्लियामेंट गया मैंने स्पीकर से कहा कि मैं पार्लियामेंट में बोलना चाहता हूं अपनी बात रखना चाहता हूं सरकार के चार मंत्रियों ने मेरे ऊपर आरोप लगाया है तो मेरा हक है कि मुझे पार्लियामेंट हाउस में अपनी बात रखनी देनी चाहिए क्लैरिटी नहीं है मगर मुझे नहीं लगता है कि मुझे बोलने देंगे मैं होपफुल हूं कल मुझे बोलने दें आज मेरे आने के बाद एक मिनट के अंदर उन्होंने हाउस को जर्न कर दिया होपफुल हूं कि शायद कल मुझे बोलने दें क्योंकि मैं अपनी बात रखना चाहता हूं मगर पक्का नहीं मालूम आइडिया यह है कि जो मैंने भाषण कुछ दिन पहले पार्लियामेंट हाउस में दिया अदानी जी के बारे में और जो नरेंद्र मोदी जी और अदानी जी का रिश्ता है उसके बारे में मैंने सवाल पूछे उस भाषण को पार्लियामेंट हाउस में पूरा एक्सपंज कर दिया गया और उस भाषण में ऐसी कोई चीज नहीं थी जो पब्लिक रिकॉर्ड से मैंने नहीं निकाली अखबारों से लोगों की स्टेटमेंट से मैंने पूरा भाषण डेवलप किया था और उसको एक्सपंज कर दिया गया यह पूरा मामला डिस्ट्रैक्ट करने का मामला है सरकार और प्रधानमंत्री जो अदानी जी का मुद्दा है उससे डरे हुए हैं और इसीलिए उन्होंने यह पूरा तमाशा प्रिपेयर किया है और मुझे लगता है कि वो मुझे पार्लियामेंट हाउस में नहीं बोलने देंगे क्योंकि जो मेन सवाल है वो अभी भी टेबल पे है अदानी जी और प्रधानमंत्री का रिश्ता क्या है जो डिफेंस कॉन्ट्रैक्ट्स अदानी जी को दिए जा रहे हैं वो क्यों दिए जा रहे हैं जो श्रीलंका में बांग्लादेश में बात हुई है वो क्यों हुई किसने की ऑस्ट्रेलिया में प्रधानमंत्री जी और स्टेट बैंक के चेयरमैन और अदानी जी के साथ जो मीटिंग हुई वो क्यों हुई उसमें क्या डिस्कस हुआ तो ये सब सवाल हैं जो प्रधानमंत्री जवाब जिसके जवाब नहीं दे पाए और ये मेन बात है मैं एमपी हूं तो मेरी पहली रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी पार्लियामेंट में जवाब देने की है और मैं चाहता हूं कि पार्लियामेंट में जवाब देने के बाद मैं आपके साथ डिटेल में डिस्कशन करूं मगर उससे पहले मैं डिटेल में आपके साथ नहीं जाना चाहता हूं क्योंकि वो वो एज एन एम वो हमारा प्लेटफॉर्म है आई वेंट टू पार्लियामेंट दिस मॉर्निंग विद द आइडिया ऑफ पुटिंग वॉट आई हैव सेड वट आई फील ऑन द floor of the house four ministers have raised allegations against me in parliament house it is my right to be allowed to speak on the floor of the house i requested the speaker today i went to his chambers and i requested him and i said look i would very much like to speak i told him that people from the bjp have made allegations against me and as a member of parliament it is my right to speak he was non committal in his way he smiled but i'm hopeful that i will be allowed to speak tomorrow what is going on here this story started the day i gave my speech in parliament about mr adani and i asked some fundamental questions to the prime minister about his relationship with the businessman about how mr adani has been given pretty much the entire india israel defense relationship how he has been given the bombay airport other airports how rules have been changed to allow him to be given these things what happened in australia between the prime minister mr adani and the chairman of the state bank and one of the chief ministers of one of the states in australia that's a picture that is visible to everybody why is the prime minister of india sitting with the state bank chairman and mr adani and an australian leader what is he discussing and why after that discussion is almost a billion dollars pledged by the state bank to mr adani what was said in sri lanka a person has made a statement saying mr raja paksa told him that mr adani was given the contract and it was basically mr modi who told him the same in bangladesh so these are relevant questions and the whole idea is that this these questions must not be on the table and that is why this whole exercise of four or five ministers the prime minister giving a speech to distract from this fundamental question which is what is the relationship between the prime minister of india and mr adani and his companies and more importantly whose money is in these shell companies who is this unknown person whose money is in these shell companies what is his relationship with mr adani is i would like to go into the details with you unfortunately i am a member of parliament and i am hopeful that i will be allowed to speak in parliament so i would like to first place place my statement on the floor of the house and then after that i'll be happy to have whatever discussion you want with me see i want to make it clear unfortunately for you i am a member of parliament and as the allegation has been made in parliament by four ministers it is my right to have the opportunity it's my democratic right 
so if indian democracy was functioning i would be able to say my piece in parliament so actually what you are seeing is a test of indian democracy after four leaders of the bjp have made an allegation about a member of parliament is that member of parliament going to be given the same space that those four ministers have been given or is he going to be told to shut up that's what the real question in front of this country is right now